Greg, thank you. Very special guest this midday, James Vance. He's the McDonald's of Las Vegas Owners Association uh, president. And uh, James, thank you for joining us Thanks here on for Midday. Me. Appreciate He's it. He's here to talk about a really cool grant program that's going to affect any of you local teachers out there, although most of them are probably in school right now. But if you do have a friend that's a teacher, let them know about this. It's uh, a giveaway from McDonald's, a grant program for local right. teachers. So, James, tell us what you're doing. So, it's called MAC Grants okay. Make Activities Count. And we're giving away $60,000 of these grants to teachers in Southern Nevada. It's an incredible, incredible program. I love it because we get a lot of applications from teachers. And we're taking them now through October 3rd. So again, I don't know if the teachers will be watching, but you know, tell their friends uh, to put in that, the applications. But each grant is $500. And they're for things like um, some people request iPads because there's autistic classes that sure. there's games or activities that can help them learn. That was one of my favorites. There's another one where they uh, made a garden and grew their own vegetables. I thought it was really cool and helped the kids learn how to eat right and eat healthy. Um, so it's all of those kind of grants. There's 120 we're going to give away. We're doubling the amount from last year because they were such a success. So That's amazing. A lot of parents watching this midday, as well as you mentioned, friends of teachers. And, of course, this interview will be online, so we'll share it that way. Um, but you're telling me the application process runs through October. Third. What yeah. do they need to do in this application specifically? Are they applying for, as you mentioned, some specific items, or can they just apply in general? So the teachers can get creative with how they use the $500. So so $500 is the limit per application, okay. but however you can use that up to $500 and just come up with whatever you want that is kind of not funded. And that, the problem with the budgets right now is there's just a lack of money for a lot of the educational programs for our kids in Southern Nevada. Uh, my wife and I, we have two sets of twins. We have, oh, by the way, Happy birthday, Sophia and Gabriella. They turned 12 today, my oh, twin girls. Happy so birthday to I them. I had to throw that in there. Yeah. So we have four kids that are uh, coming up through the, the school system, and, and it's just incredible. So the teachers come up with these very creative programs to help um, fund things that they don't have money for. So. Well, it sounds like this is a very near and dear cause to your heart because you do so. have kids but obviously just can you give us the impact of doing something like this for our community because the Clark County School District has had its struggles and certainly a lot of people focus in on the fact that they don't have enough money so um, there's no why doubt. McDonald's helping this well the, the McDonald's there's over a hundred McDonald's in Southern Nevada and, and people don't always know that and they're made up of 15 families that own those restaurants okay. so McDonald's sometimes is looked at like a big corporation but we're actually a group of families that own these restaurants and raise our children here, live in the community. So it's so important for us to give back to the communities. So this is definitely near and dear to our hearts as a way to give back to Southern Nevada uh, where we live and we do business. So it's a, it's a lot of fun too to see the kids and to know that that money is going to such a good cause. Very cool. James, thank you for coming here on Thanks Midday. James time. Vance, everyone. We're going to follow up with you and see how those teachers use the money. Hopefully in October we'll find out who's the recipients. Sounds good. Again, we're going to post this information for you online. Hopefully you can share with your child teacher or perhaps a friend who is a teacher here in Clark County. Action News Midday will be right back. Stay with us.